Hallelujah. Bible says, enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Yes, Father. Oh, yes, Father. Come before his presence with singing. Psalms 100 verse 2. Yes, Father, we come before your presence, Father, with singing, Lord. Come. Come, sweet Jesus. Wonderful Jesus. Oh, let your mighty angels accompany, Father, as we sing. You inhabit the praises of your people as per Psalms 22 verse 3, Lord. You inhabit the praises of your people. Yes, you dwell among the praises of your people. We welcome your Holy Spirit, the helper, the comforter, the mighty, the strong one. Hallelujah. Oh, shall we sing this song? Welcome, Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of me. You are the living water. Never dying fountain. Comforter and counselor. Come and take up control. Welcome Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of me. You are the living water. Never dying fountain. Comforter and counselor. Come and take control. Welcome Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of us. You are the living water. Never dying fountain. Comforter and counselor. Come and take control. Welcome Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of me. You are the living water. Never dying fountain. Comforter and counselor. Come and take control. Welcome Holy Spirit. We are in your presence. Fill us with your power. Live inside of us. Yes, Lord. Come, sweet spirit. Come. Come. Oh, the third person in Trinity. Come. The Lord is that spirit. The Lord Jesus Christ is that spirit. The Holy Spirit. The comforter. The counselor. The helper. Yes, the mighty. Strong one. Hallelujah. As per Isaiah chapter 28, verse 2. The mighty and the strong one. Yes, Father. Oh, yes. Oh, you are the helper. John chapter 14, verse 16. Oh, John chapter 14, verse 26. You are the comforter. Yes, Jesus. And the Lord Jesus Christ is that spirit. And where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. There is freedom. Hallelujah. Second Corinthians chapter 3, verse 17. Yes, Father. Yes, Father. Therefore, we come before your presence with singing. Oh, uh, we enter his courts with thanksgiving. Oh, yes. Uh, oh, we enter his gates uh, with pray, uh, with thanksgiving and his courts with pray. Because the Lord is good and his love endures forever and his faithfulness continues Throughout all generation, you are faithful God. You are faithful God. From uh, everlasting to everlasting, you are faithful. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the Holy Spirit. Oh, Spirit is moving again. Spirit is moving again. As in the day of Pentecost, Spirit is moving again. The lame are walking. 
The blind are seeing, the lame are walking, the blind are seeing. In the name of Jesus, the dead are raised again. Spirit is moving again. Yes, Lord, Spirit is moving again. As in the day of Pentecost, Spirit is moving again. The lame are walking. The deep are listening, the dumb are talking. Oh yes, the lame are walking. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have the victory. Hallelujah, thank you Jesus. Spirit is moving again, spirit is moving again. As in the day of Pentecost, spirit is moving again. Yes, Lord. Yo, Spirit is moving again. Lord Jesus, we pray, send your comforter, your helper, your mighty strong one. When we don't know how to pray, your word says in Romans chapter 8, verse 26, the Spirit himself helps us in our weakness, in our Weakness, when we are not knowing how to pray, the Holy Spirit intercedes for us with groanings which cannot be uttered. Hallelujah. Yes. Uh, oh, Romans chapter 8 verse 26. Likewise, the Spirit also helps in our weakness. For we do not know what we should pray. For as we ought, but the Spirit himself make intercession for us with groanings which cannot be uttered with groanings which cannot be uttered yes father jesus sweet jesus precious jesus glorious jesus we magnify your name we glorify your name you are good lord you are gracious lord jesus thank you thank you thank you come holy spirit we need you come Sweet Spirit, we pray, come in your power, come in your own special way. Come, Holy Spirit, we need you. Come, sweet Spirit, we pray, come in your have a come in your own special way. Holy Spirit, thou are welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou are welcome in this place. Father of mercy and grace, thou are welcome. In this place, Holy Spirit, thou are welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, thou are welcome in this place. Father of mercy and grace, thou are welcome in this place. Lord Jesus, you have promised when the Holy Spirit shall come upon you, you shall receive power. You shall receive power. Power. And you shall be my witness in Jerusalem, in Judea, in utter Paul, most part of the earth, Lord. Yes, Father, the spirit of power, the spirit of truth that was poured on the day of Pentecost. When tongues of fire came upon your disciples, they were filled with heavenly joy, with power, oh, with unknown tongues. Thank you, thank you for the spirit of power. Yes, Father, the helper, the comforter. Yes, Father, yes, Father. John chapter 14, verse 16. John chapter 14, verse 26. 
the helper and the comforter and the Lord Jesus Christ is that spirit and where the spirit of the Lord is there is liberty freedom second Corinthians chapter 3 verse 17 yes Lord Jesus pour out and you have promised in Joel chapter 2 verse 28 Acts chapter 2 verse 17 in the last days I will pour out my Holy Spirit upon all flesh upon all flesh do it Lord do it Lord pour it pour it pour it upon the Israelites upon the Arabs upon the Europeans uh, upon the Africans upon the Indians upon the Pakistanis upon the uh, Americans uh, yes among oh pour out your Holy Spirit among the Chinese uh, yes uh, pour out your Holy Spirit among the Far East people hallelujah Indonesia Cambodia Thailand Burma yes 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 uh, to the Gulf nation to the Middle East uh, pour out pour out you said in the last days I will pour out my Holy Spirit upon all flesh Acts chapter 2 verse 17 Joel chapter 2 verse 28 do it Lord pour it pour it pour it pour out your spirit pour out your spirit pour out your spirit upon all yes father oh your young man shall young uh, sons and daughters shall prophesy your young men shall see visions uh, your old men shall see dreams lord yes father pour 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 upon the jewish people oh upon the arabs lord upon the Palestinian, upon the Lebanese, upon, upon the Egyptian, upon the Syrians, upon the Iranians, Lord, upon the Iraqis, upon the Bahrainis, upon the Omanis, upon the Saudi Arabian people, upon the Kuwaiti people, upon the people in UAE, Lord, pour it, pour it, pour it. Yes, Yes, Father, in the last days, in the last days, you said uh, you will pour out your Holy Spirit upon all flesh. Do it, Lord. Do it, Lord. And you have said in Isaiah chapter 32, verse 15, unless the Spirit is poured, unless, unless, until the Spirit is poured from above, the barren land will remain barren. But when the Spirit is poured, the barren land will bloom. Oh, yes, like a forest. Yes, yes. Oh, you are the way maker, Lord Jesus. You make a way where there is, seems to be no way. Oh, Lord Jesus, you have said in Isaiah chapter 43, verse 19, Behold, I will do a new thing. I will make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert. Yes, Father. Yes, Father. Oh, you can bring rivers in the desert. You are a God of impossible. Why? 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 Because Jesus Christ is the God of miracles. He's the God who turns impossible to possible. Nothing, nothing, nothing is impossible with Jesus. With men it is impossible. But nothing, nothing, nothing is impossible with Jesus. Mark chapter 10 verse 27. Jeremiah chapter... Oh yes, Father. Thank you, Father. 32 verse 17. Jeremiah chapter 32 verse 27. Is there anything too hard for the Lord? Nothing, nothing, nothing is too hard. With men it is impossible, but nothing is impossible with Jesus. Mark chapter 10 verse 27. And you have said, Lord Jesus, John chapter 4 verse 48. Unless you see signs and wonders, you will not believe. Yes, Father, it's your heart desire to manifest your power, your glory, your majesty, your might, your mercy, your miracle through signs and wonders. Yes, you have said, Lord, John chapter 4, verse 48, unless you see signs and wonders, you will not believe. Therefore, exhibit, exhibit those sick ones, those whose leg, whose arms are about to be amputated in the hospitals, Lord. Show your creative power. Oh, create new organs, new organs, new organs in the mighty name of Jesus. 
in the magnificent miracle working majestic marvelous matchless uh, oh multiplying name of jesus yes uh, every veins uh, arteries uh, walls uh, kidneys livers heart be oh recreated replaced repaired oh replaced with a new organ yes father you are the creator you are the manufacturer you are the maker of human body lord jesus the great i am that i am oh the jehovah hallelujah thank you you said i and my father are one yes father jesus sweet precious mighty glorious wonderful jesus yes father yes father john chapter 10 verse 30 says oh my uh, father and myself are one my father and myself are one therefore uh, oh yes uh, yes uh, thank you lord thank you father exhibit your miracle working power all because we pray in the sweetest strongest sanctifying strengthening supplying sweetest name of jesus amen 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 hallelujah praise him magnify him glorify jesus amen amen anyone can continue for prayers